on YouTube, Mr. Beantown here, bringing you guys my first Call of Duty gameplay on my channel. We're playing Arms Race, and the map is Hijack, my favorite map in this game. Uh, if you guys aren't familiar with Arms Race, it's a bonus game type that they have out right now. It's TDM, well, Team Deathmatch. But the difference is every gun kill is worth 150 points instead of the usual 100. So let's get into the gameplay. It doesn't last long. You see, it's a quick five minute video. Um, I'm using the Scar H Diamond Camo. My attachments are Silencer, Fast Mag, and Stalk, so that way I can strafe while I'm aiming down the sights, as we do here. Pick up our first kill of the game, and we see another guy out here. We pick up our second kill, and then we get stabbed in the back. So, there we go. That's how we start off the match. Uh, perks, I'm using Ghost because in this game type, there's constant UAVs up. I don't want to be shooting them down all the time with the FHJ, so I'll just run with Ghost. And uh, using scavenger so I can keep spamming EMPs to take out those claim ones and pick up those free points. And then my third one is engineer, so that way it helps me spot out the claim wars and all those other equipments much easier. Uh, kill stri uh, score streaks. I'm using UAV, easy to get. Chopper, I feel felt like I can get. And if I can get the chopper, I can definitely get the escort drone. So as you see here, I pick up a nice double kill. Pick up a UAV, so we have to fall back to reload and get things started again. And as soon as we come out, we see a guy running around the corner, and we get stabbed. We watch that on the kill cam, I'm pissed at that. Whatever. People run around with stupid sniper rifles on a small map like this. But hey, whatever, to each his own. As we look out here, we see three red dots out there. Don't see anybody. We see our teammate get stabbed, and we pick up that kill. We see another one above us. It looks like we have a teammate up there with him, but I'm not sure what's going on over there. And as we make our way up there, we see that he was using the riot shield. Pretty stupid, but pick up a nice kill right from that porch we see that our opponent has a couple of pieces of equipment out over there so we throw an EMP see if we can get anything we destroy a claymore and pick up an extra 50 free points as you see here we're close to getting a kill streak. I'm not sure if it's just a UAV but uh, we go to my favorite side of the map I always try to stick to the sides of the map much easier you don't have as many lanes of uh, vision for other people to shoot you as you see we see another claymore we have another EMP, we toss it, and just like that, another 50 points. Uh, we see our opponent there has a care package back in the spawn. Looks like two of them were trying to uh, figure out how to get it, but they weren't paying attention, so we were able to swoop in there, pick up a double kill. We run around back, make sure no one else is back here. And uh, with the UAV, we see that they spawn on the opposite side of the map. We have a pretty comfortable lead, so we have a good feeling that this map's in the bag. If you guys play this map, watch this corner right here because uh, there's usually always someone on that balcony and there's usually always someone behind that post. We get the host migration that cancels out the Hellstorm missile that was going to come in and more than likely, with my luck, it definitely was going to land on my head. So we're able to continue our, our score streak there. You see that uh, that guy is still up there. Man, dude won't die. My aim is horrible, so we say screw it. We're able to pick up a nice kill right there, and we reload. Bad timing, but we dance around. We're able to pick up that other kill. We try to wait a second. We throw an EMP. We see nobody's there, so we try to get our health back, and just like that, opponent came right to us, and we were able to pick up our first stealth chopper of the game. So, key here, stay alive until we see our next, our next easy victim to kill. As we see him right there, bang. Just like that, we pick up our escort drone. And I should have been dead there, but Call of Duty gave me that and picked up a nice double kill. Still, Chopper really isn't doing much. We strafe on that dude. Nice kill. And we strafe again, hip firing. We're doing pretty well. We see that my opponent had a Claymore up there, and then we start spraying. Because we knew he was up here. He was camping up there the entire game. If he wasn't on this side, he was on the other side. So we call in our UAV, and then we just see that guy just run right by us we shoot him quite a few times but he just doesn't die and then of course his team his fucking teammates right there and we're dead time to start over i'm pissed i was like man i was gonna go on another rampage see we have another dude just camping right in there waiting we throw an emp to flush him out and that's exactly what happens we pick up that easy kill as our escort drone hasn't done anything yet horrible aim comes through again pick up that UAV, toss that, and we get a nice three-piece right there from the escort drone. That guy was just running right towards us, so we obliged and we just finished him off, and 
this part right here was just too easy. They were all focused on the escort drone, and that just allowed me ample time to just shoot them right through that as we hit them through the wall, even with a silencer. Pick up another one, another stealth chopper, but you see, there's only three kills left, guys. I'm not sure how often I'll do Call of Duty videos. If you guys enjoyed, let me know. I'll try and get more of them. But uh, until next time, guys, 31 and 3, and I'm out. Peace.